what like where do you get it from like why why is it that with you you didn't end up being the guy hitting the wall and speaking to yourself and going around in circles in the in detention center um or um you know or or, or sign that paper and go back like what is it in you that that you know um, empowered you and and helped you keep going faith i i believe that there is a tomorrow that is brighter than today i believed that no matter how long it takes to rain the clouds will clear and the sun will shine and basically but that's do you really Th- is that yeah, really that is. in you yes it's a i mean no matter how bad it is no matter how bad it gets it could be worse it could and where be do you get that from um i've reflected on through like reading and understanding other people's experiences i realized that uh, we don't decide the hands that life deals us but we decide how we can play the cards that life gives us mm. and and the whole difference between making it and and struggling does not depend on the cards that you have been given but how you're playing them yeah, but how come some people don't know how to play the cards this is the thing that i mentioned because we need all the lessons that we can learn in life but sometimes what happens is like i explained the situation of life experiences if you are going through life and you get an exam yes and there's a lesson that you have to learn and you refuse mm. to learn this lesson yes mm. Mm. this experience keeps coming back in the same mm. in different forms one year two years you're in the same place three years four years but until you accept and say okay this is what life is trying to teach me and mm. then you go to the next level you learn the lesson mm. and then you get another exam so it's uh i think what i'm really hearing there as well it's it's and 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 from hearing your story it's about taking ownership exactly it's about taking ownership for your own actions and there's right there it's it's about saying i was wrong i've been yeah. wrong or i i'm not thinking I'm not thinking right at the moment. You know, it's about owning it's it's all along those lines. It's all about saying I need to say sorry. Sorry even yeah. to myself, sorry to the people I've hurt around me in this crazy journey I've been, you know, self selfishly uh, you know, going on and and that can also be, you know, the consequence of of trying to follow a dream. You you can hurt yeah. people around you because you're so intent on trying to follow this dream that actually you don't give a shit about anyone else and yeah. and that's something to be aware of as a human and 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 as you say it's about then okay knowing and taking ownership and realizing right this lesson where i'm at right now etc it's all it's all my doing it's i, yeah. I put myself here um but but on a just on a softer level um because not everyone ends up in a detention center but on you know on a softer level they can hurt a lot of people around them along the way yeah. and again you know who knows what lessons different people get but it's it's i think that that's one of the be- most beautiful messages for me because everyone interprets like a painting right everyone interprets yeah. a, a life story differently but um for me i think what what i really appreciate from this is about you know admitting wrong admitting our own doings and owning them and then from that growing and allowing for that next exam to come our way right because we yeah. want those exams otherwise life would be so boring yeah that's right most definitely it's a uh, and sometimes it's just being open also to learn from other people's experiences because mm. um maybe you're not going to have the the exam but you need the lesson 
And that is why yeah. sometimes, I, I mean, that's why I was, I was very inspired to uh, be on your show because I think what you're doing is amazingly, amazingly inspiring because you're just putting it out there just as it is. Pick out of it what you pick out of it, but this is it. And so mm-hmm. I decided to just bring it all and say it like, like it is, just leave nothing out. Yeah. 